move over Fibonacci, there's a new math sequence in town. Can the Padavan sequence be used to win at roulette? Let's check out Padavan Streets together today on Jack Ace. <laughs> What up donkeys, Jack Ace here with jackace.com and today I have another math approved roulette system. This system is called Padavan Streets and if you like Fibonacci dozens, you'll love this one. Padavan Streets is a negative progression system where you increase your bets when you lose and reset to the first bet when you win. The Padavan sequence is 1, 1, 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 9, 12, 16, 21, each new number is the sum of the second and third numbers preceding it. So 1 plus 1 is 2, 1 plus 1 is 2 again, 1 plus 2 is 3, 2 plus 2 is 4, 2 plus 3 is 5, and so on. With the Fibonacci sequence, you add the two preceding numbers together to get the next one. That's n minus 1 and n minus 2. With Padavan, you add the numbers of n minus 2 and n minus 3. And for this trial, we'll be using a $10 unit bet. So our sequence is going to be 10, 10, 10, 20, 20, 30, 40, 50, 70, 90, and so on. And we're going to be betting on a single double street. When you win, you win five times your bet. The buy-in for Padavan Streets is $1,800, and Cody suggests walking when you're up $450 or more. That's 25%. The starting bet is just $10, but it can balloon to as much as $370 if you start with a $1,500 bankroll. So let's go. We're starting with a $7.8 million balance and we're playing on a double zero wheel. Nine, so that's a whack, minus 10. We're gonna stay at the $10 bet. So when you bet on a double street, which is six numbers, you win five times your bet. So when you bet $10 on tier one, you win $50. When you bet $20 on steps four and five, you win 100. 12, that's another whack, lose 10 again. And we go to tier three, which is still $10. With the starting balance of $1,800, that means we can withstand up to 14 losses in a row. If we have 15 losses in a row, we'll be wiped out. Really, you only need to start with $1,490 to be able to withstand the same number of losses. If you're on a smaller budget, you can just start with $1,500 or so without affecting your success rate that much. 36, that's another loss, minus 10. We're not gonna hit this double street very often, so expect a lot of losses. Like we said before, this is a negative regression system. That means you increase your bets when you lose and you reset to step one when you win. With negative progression systems, you have a good chance of coming out ahead a small amount, but there's always that chance that you're gonna lose big. 11, another loss. That time we lost 20 and we're gonna bet 20 again. This is level five. When do you walk? Cody suggests walking after you're up 450. That's 25% of his suggested buy-in of 1800. 33, another whack. Now we go to 30. This is level six. No more bets. Seven, we lose 30. And now we bet 40. So this system is easy to scale. Just take the Padavan number and multiply it by whatever you want to be your starting no unit. Bets. If you want to start with a $100 bet, just start with $100 on the double street of your choice. 14, another whack, minus 40. We are currently down 140, and we're gonna increase our bet to 50. This is level eight. If you enjoy discussing gambling systems, join my Discord. We have a pretty active community of around 700 DGENs like you. We love talking about gambling, so join today. 23, I told you we're gonna be losing a lot. We're gonna increase our bet to 70, level nine. For the first tier, you have an expected loss of 27 cents per spin on a single zero wheel and 53 cents per spin on a double zero wheel. 12, another whack, minus 70. We're down 260. Not starting out great. Now we're gonna bet 90. No more bets. Whack again. Minus 90, we're down 350, and we're gonna increase to 120. Pros, the biggest pro for this system is that when you hit, you usually springboard to a much higher level than you were before you started your losing streak. If you look at this chart, you can see if you lose 10 times in a row, when you hit on the 11th spin, you'll be ahead 250 more from when you started. One, another loss. 
we are down 470 and we're going to be betting 160. So question of the day, the Super Bowl is coming up. Who do you guys like to win? I've done pretty well betting on the Chiefs for the past two years. Do you think they'll win again? My daughter wants them to win again because she's a huge Taylor Swift fan. Okay, finally we hit 21. That's a bingo. We win 800. We're actually up 330 right now. And we're going to reset to the $10 bet level one. No more bets. Double zero, that's a $10 loss. And we go to step two, which is still $10. Also, check out my Jack Ace merch store, shop.jackace.com. There we have a ton of gambling merch, both roulette and craps and blackjack, video game merch, crypto no merch, Rubik's Cube merch, and of course, Jack Ace branded merch as well. 18, that's a hit. We win 50. And we're gonna reset to step one, which is still $10. Betting on six numbers, you cover 16.2% of the wheel on single zero and 15.8% of the wheel on double zero. 13, that's a whack minus 10. Go to tier two, which is still $10. No more bets. Twenty-five. That's another whack. Go to level three. Still ten dollars. Cons for cons. I think betting on six numbers is too small of a target. I think I'm going to do my next video with this system, betting on eight numbers instead. Thirty-four. Another whack. Minus ten. If we expand this spreadsheet to cover the eight number bet, you can see we still end up ahead when we recover. Double zero whack. Stay at twenty dollars, but we're going to go to tier five. As far as alternate bets go, there's really no improvement on Padavan Streets. If you're going to bet on six numbers, this would be the way to go. 26, another whack. Now we increase to $30. Of course, you can bet on whatever double street you want. It doesn't have to be 16 to 21. And if you want to get cute, you can split the bet in half and bet on two streets instead. Zero, whack, minus 30. We're still up 270, and we're gonna increase our bet to 40. No more bets. 17, that's a hit. That's a bingo. We went 200, and we are actually up 470 right now. That is more than our win requirement. We said we were gonna walk if we were up 450 or more. We are up 470. So we were successful with trial number one, but let's check. Trial number two. We're going to reset to $10 and start over. No more bets. Twelve, that's a whack. Minus ten. This friend, or for this trial, we are now no down $10. Two, another whack. Minus another ten. Go to tier three, which no is no still bet. $10. Twenty-two, we just missed. Minus ten, and we're going to increase to twenty dollars. Step four. No more bets. Thirty-two, whack. Step five is still twenty dollars, and I'm giving away a blackjack basic strategy card to a lucky subscriber. If you want to win one, just content antihero in the bet. comments below, and make sure you're subscribed. I'll select a winner soon and send you a card in the mail. Three, whack. We're going to go to step six, which is 30. No more bets. 20, that's a hit. We win 150. And now for this trial, we are up $80. No more bets. Six, whack, minus 10. Go to step two. No more bets. 00 whack. Step three, still ten dollars. No more bets. Ten whack, go to step four, twenty dollars. No more bets. Twenty-eight 
23 another whack. Step five, twenty dollars. No more bets. Twelve another whack. We're gonna go to thirty dollars. Step six. No more bets. Five whack. We're gonna bet forty now. No more bets. Thirty five whack. Increase our bet to fifty now. No more bets. Twenty eight, another whack. Increase our bet to 70. If you'd like me to review your roulette system, fill out this Google form. And if you'd like me to fast track the review of your system, join my Patreon. Patreon members get access to spreadsheets that I've written for gambling, a crap simulator spreadsheet and a roulette simulator spreadsheet I've written for gambling. And I think I'm gonna make my spin tracking spreadsheet available for Patreon members as well. You also get discounts at my Jack Ace merch store. And in general, it just helps support the channel. 14 whack. Minus 70, and now we're betting 90. No more bets. 36 whack, minus 90. Now we're betting 120. We're getting to the big bets now. I know it's scary to bet six numbers with a big bet, no but you got to do it for the system. Two whack, and now we're betting 160. No more bets. 36 whack. We're currently down 550 and we're going to bet 210. No more bets. 19, that's a hit. We win 1050. We are currently up $500. So that's how Padavan Streets did in the live trials. We hit our goal of being up 450 both times and we ended up 970, almost a thousand dollars. But let's check out Padavan Streets in the Jack Ace simulator. What up donkeys, Jack Ace here with jackace.com and we are testing Padavan Streets in the Jack Ace roulette simulator. We're gonna try to increase our bankroll by 450 by 900 and doubling it to 3600 a gain of 1800 trying to increase our bankroll by 25%. We were successful 70%, 69% and 67.4% of the time on single double and triple zero roulette wheels, trying to increase our bankroll by 50% by $900. We were successful 55, 53.6 and 52.3% of the time on single double and triple zero and trying to double our bankroll to 3600. We were successful 40.5 37.6 and 35.8% of the time. So yeah, pretty big drop off going from 25% to 50 to 100%. And surprisingly not much drop off going from single to double to triple zero roulette wheels. That was actually kind of shocking, especially with the number of spins per trial we were making. So really quick, let's take a look at the number map. Looks like 12 and double zero hit quite a bit. We had a total of 40 spins and 12 hit four times. Also red was pretty popular. First dozen, pretty popular. Third column, getting a little bit warm there. And we can look at the radar map. If we can see a bunch of the outliers, two numbers got hit three times and, and that 12 hit four times. So that's how Padavan Streets did in the simulator. What do you think of it so far? Here are my thoughts on it. For betting simplicity, I give it five out of five stars. I love systems where you can just make a single bet on a spin. You don't have to make a million bets all over the table. Progression simplicity, three out of five stars. Yes, this is a complex betting progression, but you can write it down if you need to. Once you've done it a few times, it's easy to remember. For chip uniformity, I give it four out of five stars. You're mostly betting the same chip, but when you get into level 10 or higher, there will be large stacks on the table. For jackpot potential, I give it three out of five stars. The worst thing about this system is that you don't really have a chance to win big. This is a risk a lot to win a fraction of your bankroll type system. Scalability, I give it three out of five stars. You can only scale this upwards really, but it's really just meant to be played for low limits. 
You can only scale this upwards, but it's really meant to just be played for low limits. Comp value, 0.5 stars out of five. With a $10 bet, don't expect free meals or lodging anytime soon. So overall, I give it three and a half out of five stars. This is a pretty good attempt at using Padavan in a roulette system. So thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this content, remember to like and subscribe. Always gamble responsibly. Never play triple zero roulette. And peace out, donkeys. Even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answer to no man, I still go. Go, go.